Put your hands together for your next comedian, Milan Patel. Milan Patel. Milan. Here he comes. Hey. Hey, what's going on? You guys good? All right, I'm good. I had something kind of weird happen to me today. I don't know if it's weird. You guys tell me what you think, all right? I was at the grocery store, and the lady finished checking out my items, and then she looked at me, and she was like, all right, 9-11, which, yeah. You know, when you look like me, that's not what you want to hear. At the, that's not the weird part. The weird part is that I looked at the screen, and that wasn't my total, so... <laughs> It wasn't even that close. My total was like $9.57, so she just saw the nine, and then she looked at me, and then her brain was like, okay, don't say 9-11, don't say 9-11, don't say 9-11. She was like, all right, 9-11, whoops, uh-oh. And Like, you know, I know the slogan for 9-11 is never forget, but her slogan should be different. Her slogan should be like, hey, maybe let it go a little bit, Carol, or something like that, I don't know. <laughs> Not that, but I'm done, all right. Yeah, look at that, Melon Patel. Very funny. Funny stuff, man. Thanks. You've been doing stand-up a while? Uh, a few years now. A few yeah. years. Yeah. Uh, all here in Los Angeles? No, I'm from Portland. Portland, Oregon. Yeah, wow. Yeah. Do you know, uh, have you ever seen a... Uh, Hell no. Uh, no, you don't know... Uh, <laughs> Whatever you're yeah. about to say, the answer is no, dude. You don't know Bruce Lerner? No, I don't know Bruce Lerner. <laughs> wow, I like your disgust about the entire situation. I don't like, I don't like this show, to be honest. I don't like this show. <laughs> Why do you and, sign? Uh, why do you sign up then? I've never been here before. I don't know who what this is. I don't know who any. Of so why did why did stick with me here? No. Why did you sign up? This felt like good exposure from uh, that one joke that I wanted to do. So, but it, <laughs> he knows me. I'm oh yeah, no, I do know. I know. Jo I like Joel though. Uh -huh. I like Joel. A lot. But you've never seen the show. Never seen the show. You've never been know. to the show. Joel was like, "Come on down. You're not gonna like anybody but me. But you should still come." And right. he, he was right. He was yeah. Right what did he that. say about Curtis? Uh, who's Curtis? <laughs> what the fuck is Curtis? I don't know who you are. I don't know. Who... I don't know who I am either. What a friendly. Sometimes. What a. Yeah. What a friendly know, fucking guy, huh? Yeah. And you? How long have you, you hated hey, yourself? Hey, you let me talk. Hey, fuck you! you let no, me fuck talk. you! No, fuck no, me! You fuck you! Fuck me! Fuck you! Fuck me! Fuck you! I'll fucking! I'll fucking! Yeah, <laughs> no, I'll no, put no, you in my hey, pocket hey, hey, and hey, jack hey, you. Hey, you, 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 you go, you go, you go. You say what you want to say. Go ahead, my. No, you go, Mitch. Foreign friend, <laughs> Milan. <laughs> you look like you moved here from Sicily like yesterday. You look. That's what you look like. Nailed it. Is he mock? You're killing it, Milan. Very I know good. I'm killing it, but it doesn't feel like I'm getting the love that I want right now. Well, wait, uh, wait. Well, can I just say we really liked you until you just started saying that you didn't like any of us. I yeah. know. I'm, you I, seem, I, you seem I know, very I know, I know. So, oh. <laughs> I got, you seem I very self-destructive, Milan. I mean, you get what you put out. You get what you put out. Listen, I got defensive. Dude, we're going to... I got I defensive. I got defensive. Dude, right? I don't want to have to do this, but you're going in a locker right now, man. <laughs> <laughs> My goodness. So, Milan, uh, <laughs> the show clearly angers you. I like how I'm getting bullied by a guy with a saxophone right now. <laughs> like, like, I'm about to fucking kill you, dude. See, I like this guy again. Yeah. I love it. <laughs> this is what you got to do. You got to come up here. And you got to wave your, you know, your, um, what, I don't know, whatever. What? Sorry. What you you got to just be funny. It's good. Uh, yeah. Just out of curiosity, how far east of here were you performing when you made friends with this guy, Joel Berg? Pretty fucking <laughs> far, Mostly actually. Silver yeah, yeah. Lake? Which yep, exactly. You nailed it. There you go. All yeah. right. I could fucking tell. Why? Why? Why half, do you say that? Because it's half written jokes and a bad attitude. That's a full. <laughs> I've been doing this for twelve <laughs> years, dude. And I, I know, did, I listen. know, I know, fucking Silver Lake, fucking I just just half do, size dorks. When I, I just see wanted it. to do this so I could just say I don't like anything right. there, you know? Exactly. Well, I like, You're too I, hip for a show that you signed up for. <laughs> Like I, it's yeah, inexcusable. But, uh, but I did good on the show, so that what does that say? You I did, don't know. You man. did, you, you did, <laughs> but it, but it, but it was it was cutie pie, and yeah. it was only thirty five seconds. It your nine eleven joke, and then you stretched it for another twenty. Like, ooh, wow, it wasn't even the thing. Bibbity boop. And you just <laughs> kept going after the thing, after the two main things. You got two laughs in sixty seconds, and then you just. I, I've never heard the term nine uh, eleven and cutie pie in the same sentence, but well, that's because you only perform on the east side of Los Angeles. I if you know. came out to where all the paid comedians. Perform, you would see a lot of jokes. I, uh, 
that you've never seen. I have. Before. I have gotten paid. Oh, before. you have. Yeah. Very good. What what type of tea bags did they pay you in down there? In uh, <laughs> it was, uh, like, was it Earl Grey or chamomile <laughs> or perhaps a free smoothie and a pancake? Yeah. Anyway, uh, I'll let you go though, since you're mi a miserable little fool. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> well, thank you. I thank you guys. I actually did have a lot of fun. I was just. Oh was well, in that case, I, I fucking liked your set. Ah, hey, uh, no, I'm you. kidding. I did have a good time. I did have a good time. Can, can I just say? <laughs> yeah. I was rooting for you the whole time. <laughs> Thanks, man. <laughs> Me too. Me I too. I was too, Milan. We all we all liked you until you this specifically said you didn't like the show, and then I, we then yeah. we all have to defend our thrones. You this know is gonna make <laughs> open mics really awkward for me. <laughs> no, I like Joel. Like, I like we, we, Joel. Are, we heard Dude, you the first time. Dude, but what about time. Curtis? Who's Curtis? I don't I'm know who that Curtis. is. All right. There was no go. reason to make fun of me. Really was no I reason know. to make fun of me. I you know, know, I know, I know. I know. I'm sorry. Can I just say to everybody here? I'm, shut up. <laughs> Can I just say one thing? Go ahead. Can I just say one thing? Yes. I am sorry, okay? Uh -huh. I am sorry for my attitude. Uh-huh. And I'm sorry... I'm not. I'm not sorry. I'm Very not sorry. good. You're <laughs> such a badass, Milan. So impressive. I hope that helps you sleep at night. Dude. There he goes, Milan right, Patel. Thank you guys. Everybody. Thanks. There you go, Milan Patel. <laughs> Team quarterback, what's up? Wow, quarterback. My goodness, what's your name? Curtis. Hi, Curtis. How are you? W are you excited to be on the show tonight? Yeah, sure. <laughs> wow. And then back over there, we have uh, what appears to be someone from uh, the movie Back to the Future, Chroma Chris. Co it's Cody Stevenson, safety, fullback, sinner. <laughs> Cody <laughs> Stevenson. He dabbles in a little bit of everything. Cody Stevenson, whose voice never changes character to character. It's always uh, pretty much the same voice every single week. How about a hand for David Deary out here hustling around? Ooh, Jeremiah's got the power sax tonight. I mean, uh, Curtis has this the beautiful, powerful Menchi music saxophone. And then there's Ludwig's own Joelberg Joel Jimenez. How are you, frat guy? You, uh, you brothers with the other guy that has the same haircut as you over here? My name's Brent. I'm yeah. the water boy, and I'll fuck your girlfriend. Wow. <laughs> What's up, Hey, y'all. Damn, we got hey, Curtis, hey, Cody, hey, and hey Brent. Hey, Brent, tell them what the A stands for on our jackets. Yeah. Anal, dude. Anal. <laughs> 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 